Hello everyone, and in this video, I'm going to go dig up some points of interest. I'm just going to cover some things. So if you watched the update 10 video, my bug of separating the grids has been fixed. So this grid here and over there was separated from this due to separating it, saving, reloading, and then the grid got separated and I couldn't join it back together. Well, that's being fixed now, as you can see. I can reattach it here. So my base is functional again. And I can continue building, but the thing is, I'm way behind on recording, and I want to stay on top of this. So, we're going to take the zip line to get around. Also, three wide is better. That cave cannibal's been down there for ages, every time I go past, he's there. So I've got one, two, and then that leads down onto the beach. I don't know if you can see it. I'm just going to go down and show you anyway, because I need to go down there and get MREs. Got this one. So if you make them three, you can slide along them and get some further distance. If it comes on an angle, it doesn't really work. See? Just stops you dead, but extra room. I like how mindless using these ones is. You just don't have to worry about doing anything. Two MREs. Oh, I needed that. There's a tarp there. Turtle should be spawning back now. Here's one. Can't carry any more turtle shells. What? I didn't even know I had one. Should have become all prepared. Where did he throw it? Why does he throw it so far away? He's thrown it away and I don't know where he threw it to. Unless it went under the ground. Very likely. Oysters. What was that ammo there? Is that always ammo there? I ain't got no idea. The good thing about this game is you can go up and down on zip lines. Kinda wish I built this one on an angle. Can't really rotate it now. It's all a learning experience. I want to fix up this one so it extends along. And then I can get rid of that wall in the middle. Calvin getting rocks. And make another water collector. Put the sticks on first before you use a turtle shell. That way I can pick up another one when I go that way. So he's still down there. Just stands there. Um, but going to the new one I built, this one was a pain to build. It was so dangerous to spot up here. I just got attacked relentlessly. This one here. As you can see, there's already enemies here. Whoa, look at them coming in. Whoa, got three power attacks in that. <laughs> Managed to kill him without him hitting me. Coming less dependent on the spear. See? So I gotta head up this way. So when I went to Europe, I took my microphone with me. Because I figured I'd do some recording there. And to get some possible tax write-offs as well. But I actually made that entire update video. What was it? Update 8. I made it entirely in Norway on a laptop. I think I did pretty well. Anyway, microphone was fine when I got there. On the way back, I had it in my luggage and... It seems to have gotten damaged and no longer works. That's my microphone, the Farka Titan one. Transparency, I should just admit that, yes, the microphone got damaged. I don't know. I felt like I packed it well enough. I had it in a hard case, but maybe it just got shaked around a lot. I've heard that baggage handlers at airports aren't exactly the most gentle. I'm not going to pass blame to them. I think I probably should have packed it a little bit better. Probably wrapped it up in bubble wrap or something. I hear music down there. Ah, this is the modern axe camp. I actually want to make a zipline going in here. That's actually an idea. The thing is with planting these ziplines is knowing where to take them to. This guy night time. In my experience on this save with going around at night time, there was an insane amount of mutants. Creepies. I'm going to call them creepies from now on. They're not really mutants. Well, they are, but it's creepies versus cannibals. Oh, what's this down here? What's that sound effect? Ah, the suitcase was wedged. Oh, cool items I can actually use. I think that's a sound effect bug that End Knight might want to take a look at. But look at all these colourful plants, it's like playing Skyrim. Speaking of Bethesda, I got Starfield, I did the Elite Edition thing so I could play it early. I opened it up, looked in the options menu and closed down the game and I haven't opened it up since. I thought about it, but I was... Uh, 
wants to put me off it. It's here. God, I've never been a fan of this system. There we go. I just dug that hole without getting interrupted once. Maintenance. I don't know, I might give Starfield a go. I've got no idea. I feel like I should. I did pay for it. There's ammo there. You can't break these to get circuit boards. Oh, there is babies down there. Come on. Oh no, I triggered the fire alarm system. Oh well. I wonder why they put babies down here. Odd design choice, someone. There's a firefighter axe. I've gotten so used to the modern axe now. Plus it's uh, nostalgic from the forest days. Got the album cover. You cannot turn the music off in here. Oh! This chess set doesn't make any sense. Why is the bishop where it is? As someone who's a big fan of chess, this bothers me. There's the next one. Food bunker. Is that a scope? Laser sight. 850 mils are in here. That's a lot. I also build a sled. Pennant line. Book. This is a nice shower, this one. Wish I had a big shower like this. I used to. It's nice to have one like that. There's a tuxedo. Sled. Save. Sleep. I'm hungry. Eh, good enough. Now there's another baby. Man, this is so hard to kill. You know, I haven't come across a golf cart in this game yet. Not normally. Only when I'm cheating making videos. Making them for update videos. Hmm, zipline rope. Something I actually need. I think this is food bunker. That way. I think one of the major mistakes I made with this game was making the map so big right at the start. Are there cannibals here? There's no one here. I'm maxed out on watches. I didn't wipe out this village, it's just completely empty. There was a fingers here. I think he chased off that cannibal that was in there. I wonder if creepies just take over if you don't interfere. Damn. Whole patrol just walk right past me. Yeah. They found me. Ah, oh, food bunker. That's the one with the puffies. The village here. <laughs> Set him free. What's with the slime? The tent's moving, but the slime isn't. What the hell? That was easy. Hang on, it's just safe for though. Oh! I guess this means that this camp is now taken over by the... Ah, uh, yeah. Okay, so that's it. So cannibals will no longer spawn at this camp because I've wiped out the inhabitants. And I think the way the game tells you of that is they cover the tents in slime, but the slime doesn't mesh well. It's a good feature. I guess it works. I cannot carry any more ropes. Make some grappling ones. I'm going to open up all the pouches. Yeah, golf carts must be really rare, the ones that you can drive. I started a new hobby, eh? Started making alcohol, distilling it. First try I got up to 89%. Pretty good, I think. No, I'm not going to be doing YouTube videos on it. Food and dining. Oh man, did I even get the... There's a key card. Yeah, I didn't... Oh no, I grabbed it. Oh, thank God, man. That would have been annoying as hell. Would have had to run back to the bunker. Bacon bites. Crossbow bolts. Email. Thought you might find this interesting. We're calling it Artifact 1. Might be related to that cube you guys found. This makes for a good green screen if you're wondering. I don't remember what's in here. Oh, the crossbow. Babies, really? That's a crossbow. Come on, get over the animation quick. Gotta hit them so many times to make sure that they're dead. There was a fingers in here. There it is, sir. Mm. Another three power attacks. <laughs> what up on my creepy armor? You can carry 15 bones, right? That means you can make three pieces of bone armor. Because a bone armor uses up four bones. Because bone armor is so underwhelming in this game, 
they should reduce the bone armor requirement to three bones. And then that way, a player can make five. I think that would be a very good change. Because bones are already like mass produced. Like you can get so many in this game. It's insane. And they've got no other use. I think they should make bone spikes a thing or something like that. Oh, I'm not looking forward to this. This fight is not easy. A letter. One more of Artifact 2. I think they are related to the cube. Clearly. What's the next one? There's Eric from the forest. Wild story. Plane crash survivor claims pharmaceutical company experimenting on mutated humans. Virginia Puffton. That means she was in here. Ooh, the shotgun Rowath. Do I already have that? Laser sight. Nah, why not? This fight's not going to be fun. There's already Puffies in here. Man, I wish I had the rifle. Man, how good this thing is at long range. God, there's so many. I just don't want to fight them all at once. Oh. Oh, what? One down. What the hell was that? <laughs> that worked. Let's make up molotovs. Make bombs up too. Three bombs. Burn their bodies so I can make bone armor. And there we go, just made nine pieces of bone armor. There we go. My friends are here. The Puftons. I ain't taking risks with this. Mm. Oh. That's one down. How do I miss this range? There we go. Too creepy. I wonder if you can burn the body. Yeah, you can. These useless bacon, meat, and brain bites, man. They give barely any hunger. I don't know why they added them to the game, to be honest. It was such an odd design choice. Hi, Robert. It was great to see you last night. It's so bizarre that Ed built this place based on some crazy vision he had. I am so sorry you have to deal with this. Let's meet again soon. Doris. There's a dress, although it's not really a dress, it's a play suit. For Virginia. I don't understand that why they added it. These brain bites and that. This is the only place you can get them and you don't see them again. You can't come back in here and I think they respawn. Barbara Puffton. Edvid Puffton. Hank, we have wasted another full afternoon still of unable to find the trace of golf balls. <laughs> this one goes on. Ah. Barbara's body disappeared. There's those clocks they added in one of the recent updates. Hmm. That was where I swam down into that spot and fell through the map and I got really pissed off. I remember that. I ate like 15 of those bacon bites and my hunger barely moved at all. It would have added less than half of a quarter probably. The odd design choices. Maybe they do have some sort of plan for it but I've got no idea. Oh god, there's actually stuff in here. How much damage did he do? Nope. It's two down. Three down. Hey, come back with my creepy armor. Well, I definitely left with a lot more than I came in with. I think I came in with three or four pieces. Maybe it's a sign I'm getting better. Should be able to change the lighter color. That would be neat. And we're out. There's these things here. There's a bacon bites, steak bites, and there's brain bites as well. But they give so little to nutrients to food. 
I just don't know why they added them to the game. Ah, uh, babies. Uh, there's one creepy. I'm just gonna exit. I'm not gonna bother with them. No, oh, great. Whole army of them waiting. Where am I? What is this down here? This is the starter location. There's a cave cannibal doing out here. The cave mutant. This is where they all got shot. Cult pamphlet. You will find meaning in life again. Yeah. Okay. That was easy. The game gets easier the more we play it. Most things. Oh, is that Virginia? It is too. Oh, she's bringing me something. That's why she's walking so slow. I'll put this on her. She stands out better on that one. No play suit. Oh, what? What? Oh my god, I just hit Alt F4 by accident. Oh, this game's spicy, man. I have to redo all that. <laughs> man, NVIDIA, when they come up with the idea for the filters to be Alt F3, it's like, really? Was that the smartest idea? Like, maybe you could pick another button. But that's the first time I've ever done that, but I didn't even think I hit it. Oh, man. Oh, uh, when was the last time I saved? It was so long ago. God, that's so annoying. Oh yeah, it was ages ago. I'm just gonna go through and do it. Oh, this game is annoying and painful. A save system. I miss saving in caves and places. Why, N9? Why are you so tight with that? Like, it doesn't make sense why you're so tight with save locations. In in the food bunker, there's no safe locations at all. I just went through all that, 45 minutes, and i got to go back through it. Because you don't want to put saves in? I, I don't know. Oh, I don't know why they're so tight with saves. It's not like it's cheating. Ah, oh, so disappointing. It's like anti-fun mechanics. Oh. It wasn't, like, horribly not fun, but now I've got to redo it all again. Yeah, I'm pretty pissed off, actually. It's my own fault, but still, it's... Yeah, I hope you know what I mean. This could have been done better. If anyone's paying attention or even watching this video, I think an ideal spot to put a save location is in that room where you find the VIP card. And the reason being is because you've got a fight coming up that involves five creepies, cave cannibals, and then you've got to fight the Puftons. It's like... That is not an easy fight. It's covered in slime anyway. I was hitting Alt F3 so I could put the overlay on so bright on the screen. Because nighttime and this is just stupidly dark. It's like you can't see anything. Which is fine if you're playing by yourself, but if you're recording, you won't be able to see anything. There's a storm coming. I shouldn't be on my computer. Well, I could have just made one of these crappy tents and saved. I suppose I could have done that. Would have shaved some time off. Five minutes. <laughs> I can't really play anymore, because there's a storm coming, and I can't save. I know I could go and play for about another 5-10 minutes, but there's nowhere to save, so I just can't keep playing. So, and like, don't be so tight with saves. It's not like it's a balancing issue. I'm just going to come back through and kill them again, my daughter off camera, I don't know. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to run back through it, and I'm going to go speed run it. But just so you know that I am using a new mod system, I'm going to cover it in another video. I hate this bug. Look at this. Why? I've also revived the dead microphone. Pulled it apart to see what was wrong with it. Put it back together. Left it to the side for like a few days. Decided to plug it in to see if it worked. And it worked. God knows. The other one that I had was the same. The fuck it Titan. But it was my test model. I wasn't exactly gentle with it when I was doing <laughs> When I tested it. So I'm just going to run through as fast as I can. You can't catch me on the gingerbread, man.
Okay. Save. Go down here. Oh. God, these ones are easy to kill. A creepy and babies up ahead, but I'm just going to skip them. Completely unnecessary. There's no incentive. Yep, waiting for me as soon as I get out again. Yeah. Got censorship even though. You wear an armor. That was easy. Oh, the creepies drink from the rivers and that's as well. You're maxed out on creepy armor. There's babies over there, so I'm not interested. Man, more. There's two up there. I'll be honest, I'd rather than you know, save here. Don't want to end my game again. I don't know when there's another night V. Oysters. There's a cannibal villager in the corner here. I hope it has a night V, because I don't want to walk. <laughs> It's too far, me. Could have probably ended up back at my base if I'd have went the other way. Yep, looks like there's a battle going on. There's a turtle. God, it's ruthless. Whoa, set him free, he's pissed at me. What? Oh, he actually killed him. Ooh, maybe they are a little bit balanced. I might go find a golf cart. This is not safe water to swim across, I believe. Ooh, it's raining. I think I've painted these already. Should have more cloth in here. Oh, cloth. Full stop. There's no cloth at all. Well, there's cloth on this one. Coming up to the golf course area, I should be able to find a golf cart up here somewhere. Okay, I'm at the golf course, but where the hell do you even find the golf cart? There's a putter, but can't pick it up. Same with those ones. And I'm gonna say it again. The map's too big. Oh, come on, man. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, there's a golf putter. Is that it? Please be it. It is it. Anyway, that's enough from this episode. Next one. I'm going to take this first one. What is Virginia doing over here? Wow. She traveled far and wide. Can't take her for a joyride. Get into the chopper. Anyway, if you like this video, make sure you like and subscribe. Cheers.